today we're going to talk a little bit about LCD testing and how it relates to HMIs that we fix in the facility. Here we have an Allen Bradley Panel View Plus 700 and when we powered this device on we were getting no display. So this is completely black. On these devices internally what displays the picture is this device here, an LCD, and one of a few causes could make this not display a picture. One of the possible causes is that the board that is providing video to the LCD through here is bad, or LCDs have what's known as backlights. And these are two bulbs, which are called cold cathode fluorescent lamps, or CFLs. And these bulbs are a lot like fluorescent lamps used in homes and offices, and the fact that they use AC power in order to provide light. Here we have a couple of those bulbs, which is the component inside that can go bad, just like a light bulb can go bad in your home. We'll show you these bulbs here. So these bulbs would be inside a housing, and that housing would look something like this. You can see the CFL bulb there. So when you're doing troubleshooting, and you're trying to determine what is bad, which could be the LCD itself, the video being provided, or simply no picture because of burnt out bulbs. We can do a test. Most LCDs have what's called an inverter. This inverter is going to take DC power and convert it to AC power to provide power to light the CFLs. Here is an inverter that we have hooked up. So this inverter we are going to use to power on this display and we are going to see if these bulbs are active and working. The first thing we are going to do is confirm functionality of our test jig here that we've worked up. So we've got it hooked up to a test bulb and we're going to apply power. This particular inverter is 8 volts DC. And we are going to go ahead and provide that DC here and see if this bulb lights up. So we will turn our output on. And here you see the bulb has illuminated. So we know that our inverter, which we are using for this test, is good. We'll turn it off, then turn it on. Now we're going to test the actual bulbs on the LCD display. Here we have the first bulb hooked up. So we are going to go ahead and provide power. As you can see, we do have a backlight. You can see that change from very dark to illuminated. Of course we have no picture because there is no video being provided, but we have eliminated the backlight as being the problem in the screen. Now we'll test the second backlight. So we are going to go ahead and unhook this one and hook up the second backlight, which we have now, and go ahead and turn on our power. As you can see, this second backlight is functional. Lastly, if we suspected that our bulbs were not getting power because of a possible bad inverter, there is a way we can check that too, using an oscilloscope. So the inverter is going to take our DC input and convert it to AC. So what we'd like to do to know that this conversion is happening will be to see that on the oscilloscope. The first thing that we are going to confirm is our DC power. So we are going to turn our power on. As you can see, we do have our backlight still, but we are going to confirm our power to the unit, which we have here. Then next, we'll want to see if this DC is being converted to AC. So we can take the probe from our scope to the top of the transformer, and we can look at our AC waveform. And there you go, we have an AC waveform. So we know that this inverter is putting out AC to the backlights. This is some of the tests that we can perform on LCD displays. Thank you for watching. For more videos, subscribe to our channel.